Hello there, I'm the base manager and welcome back to Prison Architect. Now today I think that we are going to cut off the intake of new prisoners just for a few moments uh, to allow the construction of our uh, B block over here to house all of our uh, medium security prisoners. So with that in mind, let me see what time is it? 4 p.m. Okay, there is only intake tomorrow. So right now let's close the um, what is this? Remove intake restrictions. Troublesome events. Oh, whatever. Nothing uh, interesting. Uh, yeah. So let's um, close off the intake to allow us uh, a few moments to build the cell block. And once this is done, we start uh, taking in. Uh, a few more prisoners. Whoa! Someone, someone needs a, a, a shacking. I should just, uh, I should just try to uh, create a, a room in here uh, with a a a, a, um, a guard to always uh, search these guys. But uh, whatever. See, scales over here thought he could get away with the drill. He thought wrong. And he had a gold watch. Wait. Huh? You can't have a watch in prison? Really? Okay. Uh, I, di I didn't know that. I thought that... I, uh, uh, ow! How are... Wa can someone tell me how watches are dangerous? Or, like, a luxury? It's a, it's a watch. You used to tell you what the time of the... Uh, whatever, guys. Just... just Disregard my um, my uh, my rant. It's just that um, okay, it's like I don't understand, but okay, it probably has a as a reason for that. Wow, really? So nerd gets a second parole hearing, like two days in a row. Okay, um, everybody is rooting for you, uh, Manny. So uh, hopefully you will get out early today. Oh, hello! We found an escape plan, guys! And a big one at that! Look at that! Look at the size of that tunnel! Holy shit! I know, I know, oh my god. How do I remove um, tunnels? I remember there was a way to get rid of these thingies. Oh, here it is. Foundation. Remove tunnels. The bastards, did you see that? They are almost got away with it. Almost. Wait! Nerd got uh, a parole re uh, released. Where is he? Oh, too late. We didn't see that. I just noticed that we got the... Oh, maybe... Nah, well... He got out. Apparently. Or at least someone did. Uh, it's quite easy. We just go over here into the prisoners. It was a minimum security one, so uh, there are not many of those uh, remaining. So yeah. Wait. Okay, now we have seven criminally insane uh, prisoners. Guess what? That's how many cells I have. Oh boy. Uh, can we turn these into uh, padded dormitories? Dormitories? No, we cannot. So, ah, uh, well, this is going to take a little bit of time before we can start working on the criminally, criminally insane wing. Uh, well, I'll have to build a couple more uh, cells now. Oh, come on, game two criminally insane in one day. You gotta be fucking joking. Uh, I'm going to be honest with you guys, I really don't like this uh, criminally insane turning on you uh, thingy. Well, right now, just because we have no other option, uh, we'll have to turn this into a, a padded, um, padded cell. Oh, Jesus. This is really annoying. Oh yeah, so uh, there is another problem, because, um, well, that's staff only, because it's under construction. 
Therefore, the prisoners cannot access it, therefore it doesn't count. So, screw it, let's turn it back into a cell. Here we go, cell, where is it? There we go. Okay, so, uh, right now there is nothing we can do. Someone is going to spend the night... Somewhere, I have no idea where. Uh, as long as they don't run away, it's whatever. Um, but some of the uh, these spaces will have to be turned into uh, temporary padded cells, which is kind of annoying. But we have no choice. So um, <clears throat> here's what we are going to do. We are going to ask for a couple of rooms. Let me see where is the door located. Right there. Right there. Okay. So it will be something like this, right? <sighs> uh, from all the DLC, I'm going to be honest, the, cr the criminally insane are the most annoying. They uh, offer the biggest challenge, and uh, so it's ca it can be fun, because uh, these guys are crazy and all, but still... Mm. Like, um, the prisoners should not be turning uh, by themselves into criminally insane, uh, simply because, you know? Wow, some al someone already died today. Where? The fuck? <gasps> no, it was the orderly that died. Ow! What? Okay. Uh... Russell, that was not fine. Jeez, okay, so, um, like, I have to deal with you, uh, crazy fellas, without, um, asking for it. And now you're going around and murder my staff? That is unacceptable. Well, this is going to go well. Stabbing and punching and beating and all of that, but uh, these, uh, at least these guys were uh, controlled. Clearly this guy was tased, because uh, his health bar is uh, still way too full for someone that got beaten into unconsciousness. And uh, the other guys clearly resisted. Why were you guys attacking each other? Hmm, who knows? Maybe one of these guys is a snitch. Or an ex-law uh, enforcement. Those are usually the reasons. Because as you can see, like uh, everybody is not complaining. The danger level is pretty low. Uh, even with the um, occasional gang member and whatnot. The prisoners are somewhat content. So they should not be attacking each other. So if they are attacking each other, that's most likely because one of them is a snitch. And in order to find out, one of the things that you could do is try to gather a couple of informants. Uh, while they are on uh, solitary confinement, you can recruit a couple of, re of uh, informants. But other, other than that... Uh, yeah. It's quite hard to know. But in any case, because we don't have an, um, a protective custody uh, wing... Uh, I really don't want to uh, even know that we have uh, snitches and law enforcement because then I will feel bad because I did nothing against the uh, uh, the fact that uh, I knew they were going to be killed. Uh, that way, if I don't know, I can't feel bad about it. And we got another release on parole. Fantastic, Toothil for carjacking. Uh, you know what? I got the cash, so that's all I care about. So fantastic. Holy Jesus, we have two overdoses in the same cell. Well, this must be uh, some powerful drugs, my friend. Uh, can someone please do something? Otherwise, uh, the dude is going to... Three overdoses? Three overdoses in one, in one night, all at the same time? <sighs> okay, so... Doc... Where is the other Doc? Come on. Okay, this one is already being taken care of. Anyone else? Okay, so the dock is already uh, on its way. Guard, leave the dock. 
to uh, work his magic. Three overdoses in a very in a very short amount of time. <sighs> Even though uh, our dogs, our cat sniffing, uh, drug sniffing cats are doing the best they can, there are still drugs that uh, go through the cracks. If you go here into intelligence, we can see that there is a plenty of narcotics. Hmm. Nah. Uh, I was thinking, should we do a um, a shakedown? But maybe not. Let's wait a f Is this a joke? Oh my god, this gotta be a freaking joke. I am, I am already, once again, at capacity. <gasps> like, I, I can never get stuff done like this. Okay, nope. We have to copy it like this. Uh, so we don't um, overlap walls. Bam, bam. Remove that. Nope. Get out of clone. Control. Uh, left click to give priority to everything in here. Because uh, we need to make sure that we have cells for the criminally insane because we cannot control um, their... Um, Turning rate, right? We cannot control when they are going to turn into criminal insane, so it's always a good idea to have at least a couple of uh, reserved cells for them. Uh, because if it was not for this, constantly um, uh, distracting my guys, uh, they are kind of almost done with this. Almost being the um, the word, we already have 29 uh, cells built. Uh, so yeah, we should be done with this in no time. Okay, here we go for our daily uh, dose of uh, someone is turning into a criminally insane. Oh really, so the uh, orderly can still sedate uh, non-criminally insane uh, prisoners, huh? Okay, that's uh, interesting. What? One prisoner is... Ah, uh, yep. Yep. I'm, I'm not even done with the cells just yet, and they are already turning into criminally insane, because of course they will be doing that. Well, uh, that that's fine, I suppose. Uh, you know what, guys? I'm a little bit tired of waiting. I'm going to bolster my team, and then I will fire them. I already said this like 5,000 times already, but still. We need to get this done today. And because, you know, uh, these kind of things uh, just happened, you know, that's why we need to do this kind of thing today. Because uh, one gang member has just been uh, killed. Wait, is a next law enforcement gang member? Hmm, what a combination. You were really asking for it. What, Mayor Calvin? What can I do for you? The media moved to something else and the bill banning TVs has been repealed. Okay, let's put the TVs back then. This guy is the most annoying mayor that ever mayored in the existence of uh, time. Ugh. So, TV right there and TV right there. Okay. Uh, I'm actually more worried about this than anything else, but feel free to keep uh, nagging me about TVs and uh, weightlifting and whatnot. Oh well. We are contested today. What do you want, Chief? According to some of our guards, a new radio host on the station, the prisoners listen to... Uh, what? According to, to, our, uh, to some of our guards, a new radio host on the station, the prisoner, uh, prisoners listen to, has been saying a lot of things that are riling the inmates up. It might be worth removing the radios for the time being, unless they start uh, to take uh, what you're seeing seriously. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. The current radio broadcasts are getting our prisoners riled up, but I don't even have radios, I don't think so. I mean, I have a radio in the staff room. I don't... Th uh, I don't think the game knows that. Okay, okay, whatever. Not dump, dismantle, what the hell? If you dump, uh, you will throw the item away. If you dismantle the item, you will just put it in the uh, depot. So yeah, storage that, please, and uh, let's assert, let's continue searching the cells for all sorts of contraband. We don't want any overdoses now, do we? 
I just searched this cell and this guy is overdosing. Like, uh, I searched the cell before they come uh, here to sleep, okay? I have the dogs sniffing them all. I know that they are cats and cats are no snitches. But uh, come on, Jesus. Okay, so last night we had three overdoses. Today we are on two overdoses. Hmm. Well, I mean, it's an improvement, right? Okay, guys, so... The grant for cell block B has been completed. Let's uh, go and accept a new... Um, a new grant. Um, cell block E. Whoa! 500. That's a little bit away from uh, what we... Um, can achieve. However, the criminally insane wing should be our next concern. And that's precisely what we are going to focus now that this is complete. Right? Let me just, like, uh, take a, a generic clone of this uh, thingy, because this is what we are going to build for the future. Uh, let's see. Estimated price. Just 23? Are you sure? I, I find that very hard to believe. Really, really hard. But, uh, okay. Uh, now, let's put the criminal... Should we put the criminally insane wing over here? Right in the middle of the prison? Or should we create, like, a, a, a separate uh, place for them? Now, you know what? The criminally insane, they are not that bad. You know, they interact with the rest of the prisoners relatively okay. So... Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm going to place them a little bit far away from everybody else, just in case. Come on, rotate for the first, for the correct place, please. La like this. Okay. There's going to be a couple of issues, but um, I'm sure we can manage. Uh, we should. Uh, the fence is not in the correct place for this. Fence should be moved right here. Or maybe not. Fence gate first. Then fence. There we go. Oh, come on, game. Thank you. Okay, because uh, this uh, wall is going to be broken, um, or at least this part is going to be broken, and it's going to allow the prisoners uh, to move a little bit more freely than I uh, would, would want to. But yeah, this is going to be our criminally insane wing, and uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, take advantage of this uh, open space in here, and I'm going to create a small area just for them to for them to spend the day, uh, so don't they don't they only interact with the prisoners during uh, heat time, and uh, you know work time if they have uh, things to do. But uh, if they don't, I'm going to give them their own common room, their own. Um, Visitation, uh, yeah, yeah, we can do a, a visitation uh, corridor through here. Yeah, yeah, their own visitation, parole, and uh, all of that. Oh, of course, uh, much, much smaller than uh, in here, but uh, still, uh, that should prevent them from um, walking too much with the general population. Now, guys, we can already complete the um, psychic ward grant by simply hiring a psychiatrist, going into rooms. Uh, office, it's a psychiatrist's office, go like this, go into objects, and give it a white sofa, I believe, yep, a white sofa, there we go. Once this is done, we will get the criminally insane wing uh, grant, because the that's the only requirement that we are missing. And there we go, 15k for grant completion, let's go to grants again, and uh, yeah, things are starting to go uh, a little bit uh, um, on the, th on the uh, all, all, all the qu quests are completed. Let's start by going into the green machine, because we are starting to roll, uh, run low on power, as you can see. The entire capacitator, uh, capacitor, capacitor, um line has already be completed we cannot add any more so um, this is all the power that we are going to get so let's go into the green machine and uh, let's go for the green machine <clears throat> and see what uh, do we need to do
Ok, so we need to purchase and install a solar panel, a wind turbine and an hybrid between the two of them. So we go into utilities and for now we only have the solar panel I believe. Yep. Uh, we can build them on the outside, however... Let's see if we can use green energy to power the criminally insane uh, uh, wing, right? So let's put uh, our power over here where the prisoners are not going to be able to access it. Let's go for a couple of these and now if we go into grants, green energy goals, the green energy goal one is to purchase uh, three solar panels. And why is this relevant? Because the... Um, it unlocks the wind turbine, so we can do the energy gold number two, which is to uh, purchase uh, three wind turbines, which are... Where are the... Maybe I have to go like this. Yep, wind turbines. Here we go. We need to buy three of these. There we go. Now, if we go into grants again... Green energy goals, these should be um, achieved in a matter of moments. And there we go. Energy goal number two completed. Now energy goal three is to export a thousand units of power. Now, how do we do that? I believe... Well, what is this? Scanner machine. A machine for delivery areas and storage rooms to scan wooden crates for contraband must be wired to a scan monitor for a guard to spot contraband. A guard's ability to spot contraband will depend on their tiredness. Yeah, we have the dogs for that, don't worry. Uh, now... Doo -doo -doo. We have these hybrids, of which we also need to install one, but uh, we are going to install just one right there and now we need that's just to complete the quest and uh, now we need transformers that convert the electrical power generated by green energy sources into appliance friendly energy multiple energy sources can be connected but transformers have an input limit of 5000 units of power electrical cables must be connected blah 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 and about this power export meter an object that allows you to send off any stored energy back to the grid for financial return must be wired to a transformer that has batteries connected to function correctly huh okay okay so if i if i am un am understanding this correctly we need a transformer right And then we need to connect that, right, with the electrical cable. Is that uh, correct? I don't see any sort, any um, different cables, so that must be it, right? I suppose these are, are all going to connect it. If not, I will just build more. And from here, we have the batteries. No, the batteries must be. Converted by transformers must be placed adjacent to a transformer, so I suppose that the batteries are going to be placed somewhere around here. I don't know. Let's wait for this to be built before we uh, jump into any conclusions. Oh, oh, oh! Look at that! We had someone overdosing while digging a tunnel. And a. Holy! You son of a bitch. How? How did you dig up all of this tunnel in one day? One. Day. Bro. Beat this guy. What? What are you guys waiting for? Beat him! Jesus, but okay. Another tunnel de uh, that uh, someone decided to dig during the day. I suppose that I should give you something else to do, right? Yeah, yeah. Leave the prisoner outside the prison, the the, the prison walls, unattended. Mhm. Mm 
Yep, sounds like a great idea. I, I think that's precisely what you should do. Okay, so it's sti we still have time. Yep, we still have time. Uh, so, this cell block has finally compl been completed. What is this? Uh, MedSec grading. Okay, so I think I understand this, these grading things. Um, th this is basically like... Um, the higher the grade between uh, different uh, sectors, the higher the chance of having a, a medium security sector uh, prisoner turn into a um, minimum security one in the transfer section over here. Right? Oh! It would appear that we have a, uh, a prisoner that uh, wants to be uh, transferred. Or maybe not. Zero prisoners, eleven... Oh, we have eleven prisoners waiting to transfer, but the zero of them are ready for that. If I approve all, what happens? Oh, it only approves the qualified uh, prisoners, right? But uh, because I have zero, nothing is going to happen. Right? Yep, nothing happened because uh, no one qualified for that. Uh, okay, uh, but uh, yeah, this is pretty much uh, for right now. This is nothing that we want to concern ourselves with. What we want is to do this: medium security. Bam! There we go. Now only medium security uh, prisoners will be housed in there, and uh, we have the capacity for oh, only for 62. Hmm, that's a shame, because uh, yeah, that that means yep. Yeah, It is what I, what I I thought. This means that we cannot turn this into a criminally insane, or can we? Because we need to build another one, and I would like to have them adjacent to each other. But at the same time, having them uh, split could be useful, as uh, it um, spreads the prisoners around the prison, and uh, the farther they are away from each other, the less likely they are to uh, cause... Um, damaged hmm, damage to each other you know start fightings and whatnot because of rival gangs and shit like that uh, it is a shame but uh, at least now yeah yeah hmm. I need to think about it for a moment holy Jesus that's a, a, a huge shopping list bro you just empty out my bank account <laughs> what the hell Jesus! Okay, so the green energy sources are done. However, apparently this is not connected, is that it? Yep, it is connected, so now we go into batteries, right? And this should, in theory... I know, because we still need the export thingy. An object that allows you to send off any stored energy back into the grid. So this must be it, right? I need to connect this thingy into the general grid over here. So if I go like this, right, okay. I have an idea. If I put the uh, exporter right here. And then use this thing over here to power the criminally insane wing or uh, sec uh, medium security thingy. We'll see in the future. And then use this line over here, right, to connect over here to the transformer. And the transformer will connect over to the other line. And this line is connected to the uh, power station, which should allow for the power oh no wait it says it must be wired to a transformer it says nothing about being wired to a power station I'm being stupid cancel this cancel 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 did I really just cancel my blueprint did I really Okay, that was annoying, but um, sure. Um, 
as I was saying, so if we don't need to be connected to the thingy, we can just connect it over here, right? And see what happens. Now, guys, while we wait on the green energy thingy and the, uh, this, war this uh, cell block to be built, we have to think about something. The cell block B is different from the cell block A, where this is pretty much just dormitories, nothing special, uh, right? But the dormitories have an in-cell shower head. Uh, the cell block doesn't. The cell block has a, com a common shower room that the prisoners will have to use to take a shower. No. Now, that causes an, uh, an issue because this is a, a shared facility by medium and low security and high security and, and stuff like that. Maximum security, I mean. Which means that first we need to give the medium security prisoners time to go to the shower and put them on lockup right there. So they have time to pee, and if they don't have time to pee, they are, there are toilets over here. Uh, three of them don't have a door, apparently. Well, apparently there was a, a time where they had, but they probably got cancelled. Or some shit like that. Uh, in any case, where was I? Grants, not Grants, Regime. And, because of this, we also need to change our deployment. Right, because uh, during the six uh, schedule time, we have to put a guard over here. Over here, I said. Thank you. These two guards are going to be here during the. Uh, not right now. Remove. Six time. Okay, and now during seven time, I want two guards and a patrol for both guards and dogs. There we go. Now, the outside patrol is for one guard over there, one guard over there, one dog over there, one dog over there, during the seven. And the inner is for two armed guards, should they be needed. Oh, not guards. Come on. Armed guards, should they be needed, they are in the center where they can be called to address any situation. Okay, so that's it, right? During 6, we don't want uh, the patrols to be active. However, I, w I still want a couple of guards to remain inside the, um, the block itself and a couple of guards to be inside of the shower room. Okay. Now that takes care of the deployment, everything else is ex exactly the same. So... Uh, uh, uh. There we go. Like this. Everything else is exactly the same except with uh, this just lock up, just to give them time to pee, and if they don't, they have rooms over there. So, great! I suppose that. Um... Come on. It's not what I want. I don't want to put a card inside of a toilet room. Uh, in any case, this cell block is done. We need to take care of this blo block as fast. Yeah, okay, uh, mm, yeah, please keep on uh, taking care of my uh, money, like that, sure. Let's go to Grants and uh, start uh, getting a, a few more uh, <laughs> money inside of the, uh, the, 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 the prison, because uh, we are going to uh, be on some trouble times soon enough. Um, No, yeah, like this mission, no, screw this one. Nope. I'm not going to do that one. I don't like that mission. Uh, achieve the 104 prisoners after release. Yeah, I only released like 6 or 7. So, no. I, for this I need to build a restaurant. For this I need to build a bakery. For this I need to wire some farm stuff. I need to build crops and stuff. Oof. Yeah, from all the missions, the one that seems easier to do is the basic farming, and then it allows us to do a couple extra uh, missions that uh, just um, well would be nice to have. I could get a um, a bank loan, but I don't feel like doing that if I could avoid it. So, oh, what am I thinking about? I have so much room now for, for prisoners, it's time to start taking in more. 
uh, not full to capacity I want a number per day and I kinda want a bunch of uh, low security prisoners because uh, these don't cause any trouble and a few medium security ones okay like this Okay, like this. 10k worth of prisoners. It should arrive at 9 p.m. I think we still have time. Right? Yep. Uh, 9 a.m. I mean. So... Where is it? Yep, in 18 hours we will get paid 10k and that uh, will bolster, bolster, bolster our bank account a little bit and uh, allow us to finish this. Hopefully. May I ask why you are not working? When, when we clearly have stuff to do. May I? Look, this is what happens when you don't work. Are you going to get back to work now? Are they trapped? Maybe... Oh, I, I think I know what is going on. Because the deliveries are full and the depot is full. There is no place to pl put the items that we bo uh, bought. Ah, Jesus, deliveries. Let's increase this once again. There we go. Okay, look, we already have uh, released the uh, 12 prisoners. Which means that we finally have our prison grading and all of our stats. So, in this short... Uh, what day is it? Doesn't they? Oh, day 19. In this short 19 days, we had 77 deaths in custody, one staff fa fatality, well, and zero escapes. Four early paroled, of which zero reoffended, and we have a 9% reoffending rate. I'm going to be honest, it's not the worst thing in the world. We could get a, a little bit more in the security grading. I'm not uh, super content right now with this. And uh, a little bit more in reform. We should start uh, thinking about a few more plans, but giving our bank account, I don't think that's going to happen anytime soon. Okay, guys, so even though there is no one uh, sleeping in the um, medium security uh, sector, given the recent problems that we have with overdose and uh, the supply of contraband that we have on our prison, I think today is the day that we are going to do a shakedown. Let's see what uh, contraband do we found. Well guys, that was a successful shakedown. Look at the amount of garbage that we found. Jesus! Now everybody is going to be super upset today. Uh, they are... N the level of contraband... Are you kidding? Look at the amount of stuff we just found. How the hell can they... they can't... Ow! Okay, we got rid of everything. And surprisingly, the danger factor has pretty much been reduced to zero. We got away with doing that uh, shakedown. I also increased, like, just placed the um, storage of... Yeah, I don't think no one is uh, escaping through there. There we go, 10k worth of prisoners. Um, a lot of the contraband was hiding in the um, boxes that we have over here. I think that now I understand the uh, scanner machine and scanner monitor. Uh, I suppose that um, if we created a, a door, you know, for example like this, I would have a scanning machine, I don't know, something like this, and a monitor, you know, something like this, I don't know. Uh, I don't know if I have to put this in the middle of the way and the, the um, workers go through the machine, or they place the box inside of the machine and they check it. I don't know, but I will experiment with this once I have my permanent storage room. Right now, these things are kind of expensive and we don't have the money to play around with that. Okay, so we can export... Power exp... No, don't go away! No! Ah, You bastard! 
But I suppose from what I could understand that I could I need to have the batteries and then once the batteries are put in place we are going to start storing energy and this will sell the energy back into the grid. Let's see if these warnings go away after we pl place the batteries. Nope, we still have these uh, uh, electrical warnings. I don't, 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 don't understand why. And it's not charging. Do you think it's producing several, 700 uh, units of power? And it's not charging anything. It's not connected? Uh, utilities... This thing... Oh, wait! I lied! There is charged. It's just super slow. Okay, so... Uh, <clears throat> I suppose that this is... Um, one time... One... Like, once a day, we'll sell the power that we have in, in store, or something like that. I don't know. We'll see. Let's wait for the end of this day. I'm just going to times four. four. Hopefully nothing bad will happen. And by the end of the day, we'll see if we get to sell all of this power. Okay, the chief is calling us again. Let's see what does he want. The radio host has apparently fired after a lot of complaints. There shouldn't be any more problems with the radios. Okay. So, during the day, we charged the battery up to... Oh! Yes, yeah, so because the solar is not working, the uh, power production has been reduced. Okay, makes sense. We are still charging, and we haven't sell anything just yet. Okay, uh, let's keep on waiting, then. Oh, someone died. No one saw anything? Okay. That uh, was unfortunate. Let's uh, see, 8 deaths so far, but uh, our reoffending rate has uh, been reduced to uh, 7%. So that's great, I suppose. But we lost some prison value. Oops. You know, these kind of things uh, happened. But uh, today was actually a very profitable day for us. We had like 2 uh, parole really. Shit! I didn't see. Where was it? I believe it was over here. Quickly, someone is dying. No, it's not this cell. Maybe this one. No. This cell? Oh my lord. Go there. Uh, so... Th uh, the fuck are you doing? Why are you transporting a, a vial of poison in your hands? I, I don't think that's how things work around here. Uh, in any case, so uh, three overdoses once again. These guys are asking for it, guys. You know what? They, they are asking for it. We still haven't uh, sold any power, but at least we are charging the batteries now. And um, we... Power expenditure, one unit. Oh, because now we are now connecting things, right? Yeah, we are starting to connect the lights and stuff. Oh boy. This is going to be great. Now this is the thing that I am kind of... Um, of uncertain on how it works, but uh, I suppose that over time I will find out. But uh, in any case, guys, in this episode we went green and we are going to continue to pursue that uh, quest line. Uh, maybe we can even make some money out of this, you know, with this uh, power export uh, thingy. But uh, in any case, I believe this is all the time that we have for this episode. Like I said, we went green, we expanded quite significantly, and we are going to continue to follow that direction. But uh, in any case, guys, I hope that you have enjoyed this... Oh my god, I'm not going to say that again, I am. Yep, I, I was. In any case, guys, if you have enjoyed the episode, please con uh, consider subscribing to the channel and help the channel grow. But uh, in the meantime, this is the base manager signing out. Bye-bye! Mm,